The Congress flag fell from the post while Sonia Gandhi tried to unfurl it on the 137th Foundation Day of the party at the headquarters in Delhi. The flag was unfurled but it could not be hoisted. In the video, the flag could be seen falling off the post as Sonia Gandhi tried to hoist it. Workers are now trying to fix the issue so that the flag can be hoisted. Sonia Gandhi along with party treasurer Pawan Bansal and AICC general secretary KC Venugopal held the party tricolor in their hand and displayed it briefly. A Congress worker later climbed up the flagpole to string the party tricolor. Senior Congress leaders Rahul Gandhi, Priyanka Gandhi Vadra, Mallikarjun Khadge were among those present at the party headquarters. Meanwhile, in her address on the Congress Foundation Day, Sonia Gandhi indirectly slammed the Bharatiya Janata Party and alleged that they are rewriting history to give themselves a role they don't deserve. Sonia Gandhi said that the best traditions of the parliamentary democracy are being deliberately damaged. Divisive ideologies anchored in hate and prejudice and which had no role whatsoever to play in our freedom movement now are causing havoc on the secular fabric of our society, Sonia Gandhi said. Dear party colleagues and party workers, 136 years ago today, the Indian National Congress was founded and established. Over the decades, it has confronted several challenges and it has always demonstrated its resilience. Today, we rededicate ourselves to the ideals, values and principles of our organization that has been shaped, guided and inspired by some of the greatest, noblest and most selfless of Indians of the 20th century. Divisive ideologies anchored in hate and prejudice and which had no role whatsoever to play in our freedom movement are now causing havoc on the secular fabric of our society. They are rewriting history to give themselves a role they do not deserve. They inflame passions, instill fear, and spread animosity. The finest tradition of our parliamentary democracy are being deliberately damaged. The Indian National Congress will fight these destructive forces with all its might at its command. Let there be no doubt on our steadfast resolve. We have never and we will never compromise on our fundamental beliefs that are part of our glorious legacy. Electoral ups and downs are inevitable, but what is enduring and lasting is our commitment to the service of all people of our diverse society. On this occasion, I send my greetings and good wishes to the millions of congressmen and women across the country. And I'd like to take this opportunity to wish you all a very happy 2022. Jai Hind.